Welcome to Family in Focus. We are going to get all touchy-feely today. Trafford, I just love seeing old couples walking down the street holding hands. Yeah. It just warms my heart. Sure. Is it important? It is. Yeah. It is. Maybe that's why you saw them as an old couple. That's right. Yeah, they know what to do. When we're going together, we touch lots. When we first fall in love, there's a lot of touch and we hug and we, you know, we love that touch. We're excited. The tricky thing is and sad things for a lot of couples mm -hmm. is when they get married after a while, that lessens. Right? Okay. That sort of just drops away. Maybe not intentionally, but just, oh, they're busy, they're darting around and the kids come along. You know? And one of the secrets of marriage, they're on, the old couple's onto it. You've got to keep up that non-sexual touch. Okay. So often we'll touch, sexual touch is about touch where we've got the goal in mind of having sex. So I'll give a hug and then we think, yeah, this is going to lead on to something. You know? <laughs> uh -huh. But smart couples say, no, 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 they're aware that non-sexual touch, which is touch for touch sake, it builds intimacy and closeness. It recalls those fun days. It's building intimacy in a much broader level than just physical intimacy. Okay, so but why why does it die off? Why do some couples just stop touching each other non-sexually? Oh, again, because it, it, they just they lose the the they kind of just forget how important it is. Okay, life just gets they forget. And how do you build a relationship through non-sexual touch okay. in a marriage? It's it's about holding hands as mm -hmm. you walk down the road. Right. If, if for those who go to church, just sit nice and close and touch in uh -huh. church and be seen to, to be touched. You know, it, it's about when you're sitting watching telly, don't sit in two separate lounge. Just sit in the same lounge and reach out and touch a leg. Okay. <laughs> it's even looking eye to eye. The research shows that even looking eye to eye is kind of a form of, of touch. Mm -hmm. we're, and maybe one of the most important ones where we're looking and we're conveying love through the touch. Right? So it's not, it, it mustn't be touch where it's forceful. Mm -hmm. It's not any kind of, you know, bullying or non-play. It's, it's got to be gentle, it's got to be fun and safe. Yeah. In the sense that if the person's a bit fearful, we're starting to lose. Mm -hmm. You know, it's, it's losing what it's all about. Yeah. So it's about that warm, affectionate touch and, and just staying in touch through that, that way, like we did when we were going together. We've got to get the romance back. Uh -huh. Yeah. Hug lots. <laughs> yeah. Okay. When you come home, kiss, for, hold for 10 seconds, you know, mm -hmm. all that, keep that stuff going. Do a proper send off, a good goodbye kiss. Yeah. Yeah. yeah don't lose that stuff. It's vital. Okay, great. Thank you so Thank much, you. Trafford. Good on you. Thanks for watching and we'll see you soon.